We don't know the answer to that question either, but in a sense, that's a standard strata problem. Strata owners every day are faced with the issue of how to fund capital works in their property. What mix of a sinking fund or a special levy or borrowing that they should have. So this is a standard problem. The issue with fire safety and with cladding in particular, that this is a completely unanticipated one. So when owners do get used to the idea that there is a problem, it must be rectified, what's the best way to rectify it and what money that's going to cost, that's the time to start thinking about how best to fund it. It's possible that some people might use their sinking funds, but this is unanticipated, so in reality it's going to be a mixture of special levies and borrowing. And look, there's a reason why cheap and nasty are usually in the same sentence. This is an area where people's safety is involved. It's an area at the moment where people experience horrible increases in insurance premiums, and they can expect to have decreasing property values. You actually want to get this one right. And if that involves paying extra on professional fees, or extra for one more round of testing, whatever it might be, that's going to be an investment which is worthwhile. Borrowing, on the other hand, offers an immediate solution. All work can be done now. We don't have to wait for the people who can't afford to pay. Neither do people who can't afford a large special levy have to sell their unit and get out of the property. And for a large number of owners, particularly investing owners, it's actually going to be cheaper for them if the corporation borrows on their behalf.